Hello everybody, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch with a bit of an update on the whole Armory game engine situation. Now, if you weren't following along, basically about three or four days ago, out of the blue, the patron page for the Armory game engine was just outright removed. All of the people that contributed to the project had all of their funds refunded, and it basically, no further information from that. Uh, Patreon just basically shut it down and gave back all the contributions with no more detail. So this left a lot of people wondering exactly what the heck is going on. And this is important because Armory Game Engine is basically funded using Patreon. This is the number one funding source. As far as I know, it's the only funding source. So to have that basically taken away shortly after they just hit their full milestones and the developer is basically dedicated full time to this project, well, that kind of sucked no matter how you look at it. So there's a lot of concern over, you know, did um, the Armory Game Engine pull the plug or or what's up? Like, why would Patron do this? And I've never heard of Patron doing this before. So, you know, obviously there is a bigger deal at work here. So a lot of us were actually quite concerned about the status of Armory. Now, if you've never heard of it, Armory is an open source 3D game engine that runs directly inside of Blender, but you can target multiple platforms using the Hacks programming language. I've done a full-blown tutorial series on using Armor available on Dev Game. I'll toss that link down below. I'll also toss the link to the original story down below and the link to the new story down below because there is an update and I've been waiting the last couple days for this update and I think a lot of you have as well and basically Lubos the developer behind Armory made this following tweet after patrons removal Armory has dedicated funding page now to stay safe full story at armory3day.org and the cool thing is a day or two ago Lubos went into the forums basically saying I don't know what the hell is going on I don't know what's up with Patreon I am waiting and asking them but don't worry project is being continued nothing has changed on that end so if you're um interested in checking out the Armory game engine, don't worry, it's not going away. But this funding setback certainly does suck. And, uh, you know, without further explanation from Patreon, wow, they really dropped the ball on this one. So I think we should kind of hold their feet to the fires on this one. I would recommend, you know, until further details come out, like unless there's some like, you know, murder body somewhere off in a, you know, pit somewhere, Patron owes an explanation. Patron owes an explanation to the developer, and Patron owes an explanation to all of the people they refunded. Like, this is just odd to just shut down a project people are supporting, give them all their money back, but not explain at all why in the email. And to follow that up, we've got a bit of more detail and a bit of a way how you can support Armory going forward, especially if you're one of those existing patrons that just got all of your money back and you're sitting on it. Well, maybe consider dropping it over here into the new funding system. Um, so hopefully Armory can keep going. So hopefully they can and bounce back and get on their feet and fully funded as fast as possible. So now there is an Armory um, funding page. I've linked this in the linked article, but I will also link it down below. And basically, he is using Gumroad now to finance because, as he's learned here, he can't trust um, Patron. And this is a bit of a, a warning lesson to everybody, to be honest. You can't single source income in this day and age. Uh, you know, if you depend on AdSense and AdSense shuts you off, you're screwed. If you depend 100% on YouTube and YouTube shuts you down, you're screwed. Or apparently nowadays, if you depend on Patreon and the Patreon can just decide out of the blue to shut you down, and well, you're screwed. So uh, it is a good idea for, you know, there is an object lesson here for every developer out there. You are at the whim and mercy of these services. And Patreon's track record as of late hasn't been great. They've done a lot of dumb things since they started. They're a great project. I use Patreon. I love Patreon's idea, but they just keep doing stupid stuff. And I think they just added another stupid to the list. Now, of course, I'm waiting to hear from them. Now, you know, they, they could have a full story here. Um, if you read here, what they're basically saying is, uh, I learned the page was off due to suspected fraud. Uh, so basically, that's all he has heard back um, from Patreon. There's been no word if this is or is not a mistake. You name it. Uh, but again, no matter how you look at it, Patreon made a mistake by not telling people why the refunds were being issued. It causes a crisis of faith in faith in the project that they're backing. It makes Patreon look bad. It definitely hurts Armory here. So Patreon, no matter how you look at it, even if they have a very legit reason for doing this, their way of going about it was garbage. And if they don't have a legit reason for doing this, and this is an outright mistake, the fact that three days later they haven't fixed or addressed it is horrible. So this is one of those things I think that if you're on Twitter, you might want to shout out at 
patrons say, hey, what the heck? Oh, what's going on here? And maybe we get enough voices crying out. Something will be done about this. Because how many people are depending 100% on Patreon? They can just be turned off the next day without explanation to the person or the backer. That's just absolutely insane. So a little bit of good news to end these things off. Yes, the Armored Game Engine is continuing. If you want to support it or if you supported it before, there is this new donation page being run. Uh, a very similar concept. You can donate at um, a monthly amount. He's set up some tiers uh, for what you get out of it. Um, it, but mostly it's, it's an open project. It's already open. It is staying open. Uh, but if you, you know, supported before, or you are interested in this engine, uh, more than ever, he needs the support now. And hopefully eventually patron gets to their senses and comes back and turns this all back on, or at least explains why they turned it off so that other projects that are considered using patron in the future will consider them a viable option. And this is one of those things that this shouldn't just be about armory. I think Everybody should pick up the story and start asking patron, hey, what the heck are you doing here? Because if your own patron is at risk without any explanation and potentially everyone gets refunded without explanation, there's something seriously broken in that setup. Or if they made a mistake, they should be accountable for it. They should be accountable faster. Now, the only thing I can say in their behalf is they might be all on vacation. Who knows? I, Maybe you shouldn't shut down accounts just before the uh, holiday weekends start kicking in, but uh, maybe it's the July 4th weekend and that's why they're not responding. But again, that's not a great excuse, especially in this day and age. But even if you're not supporting Armory, if you support the concept of Patreon, and again, I do. I love the idea of Patreon. It's a way for people to, to you know, back people like me. And as I mentioned earlier, you can't depend 100% on um, YouTube revenue because they can turn that off or it can just basically go away the next time they get caught doing something dumb like terrorist videos beside child videos you know things happen and you can't depend on one source but it's one of these sources that we were depending on well they just became a lot less dependable so anyways let me know what you think down below um what do you think of patron what do you think of patron's actions here uh are you going to continue to support the armory game engine if so again do be sure to check him out through his new gumroad uh funded service this is directly controlled by him so he can't just be shut down uh like he just had it happen so the good news is the armory game engine is alive and well so we don't need to worry about that one too much uh but it is now going to be struggling for funding so if you were helping it before for you, hopefully you can help it again and we can just see that money that was all refunded shifted to this alternative source and life goes on uh but again if you are looking at funding your project entire through patron uh let this one be a bit of a warning to you and if you're from patron and, and you can chime in on what exactly happened here i would love to hear about it in the comments down below as well and that's it for now i will talk to you all later goodbye